semifinals, and here's a couple of gentlemen getting ready for a fight, only the fight is going to be on the golf course. Uh, shirts clearly are optional. We've got a crown involved. This is my kind of golf. Giuseppe, newcomer versus Champ V, who we've seen a bit. Five seed, eight seed, trying to uh, qualify for a world championship, uh, trying to make history in this game. And a five seed or an eight seed is going to go into the finals because one of these two is going to stay alive. Nine hole game, single elimination. And last week, we've done 16 weeks of these somehow. It's been a blast. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you haven't played this game, go download it, goldentee.com slash Apple or Android. It's Golden Tee, man. I mean, it's perfect for any occasion. And these two are some of the best you will see. So if you go back, subscribe to our YouTube channel, watch some of these matches. They have been electric. That thing is just rolling and rolling and rolling. Um, and we're going to keep producing content, that's for sure. But we got to talk about these two because look at that. Drano, Champ V, knocks it in. Weeks ago, this would have been magnificently exciting. Uh, now, it's still exciting and impressive, but these guys are so good, you just boop, expect it to drop. Giuseppe now trying to answer, bringing it in a little right to left. Can't get it to curl in, and just like that, you are down a stroke by birdie, doing everything we ask you to do. You're already down a stroke. All right, there is the scorecard. Giuseppe versus Champ V, and Insta Fireworks, for sure. All right, so now, hole two, drivable par four. We've got rocks all over the place. Rocky Hollow is a wonderful course because it gets a little weird sometimes. Who doesn't like to get a little weird sometimes? We've all been quarantined, right? Things got to get weird. That's why I love Rocky. A couple of holes on here where I imagine rocks will come into play. Doesn't come into play there. Giuseppe with an eagle. Champ V with an eagle to stay a stroke ahead after the chip-in. Look at that scorecard. First par three incoming. And this one, not your normal early par three. Downhill a ways. Distance you have to play. Wind cutter applied. Oh, dang. Dang, dang, dang. I'm about to light it up. I was about to go nuts here uh, with my commentary because I'm running out of opportunities to do it. This looks really good as well. Giuseppe, can we tie this game? That thing just didn't come back in as hard as I thought it would. But still, very, very solid. Replay, please. Great shot points. Tiebreaker. Could and most likely will be important at some point. Who knows? Left to right. And just scooted by. I thought it would cave in a little bit harder. It did not. Champ B. Birdie. Rhymes-ish. Giuseppe. Wow. Should have should have waited. Should have let that thought linger a little bit. And uh, I would have I would have held the whole thing together. Okay, favorite hole, maybe in the whole game, hole four. Now, good wind here, which could change the strategy. Par five, you're going to start by parking it in this fairway. That's a, a really good place to be. You don't want to be too close to that rock wall because you're going to have to hit a fairway wood over there, and it needs to get up and over. Let's see. Both should be fine. This is the shot I really like. Because is this thing going to hit the wall? Yes, it is. And what's it going to do next? Oh, it looked, it, it was like tracking perfectly. And then it looked like it hit like a second piece of that slab and, and diverted. All right, how about here for Giuseppe? He's going to carry the whole thing. Oh, without backspin. If that's a wind cutter, I'm not sure if it stops. But if it does, then it's got a chance to go in the hole. Because the line with that right one, right two is absolutely pristine. As is. Difference right now, still that hole out champy with a lot of blue. Good look here on the drivable par four. This hole can set up really challenging. This is a great look for it, especially with that high loft driver. If you've not played that club yet, go to our, our club screen and give that thing a look. I'm not just saying it because it costs money, but you know, it, it you know, or gold, I should say, or money. I forget. But it's a great club. It is a worth the investment. Champy, I'm spamming you. I'm sorry. Let's get back to the match. I can't help myself. And, and again, the difference in these matches now, it's no longer just someone missing a pot or a chip or something. The, the difference in a lot of these matches is who takes advantage of hole one and, and chipping, like the, those really hard chip-ins. How about this? That's a good shot. Are we GSPing? We are not. Different um, strat for Giuseppe here. Coming in low with the sniper. Looks good. Just a little bit deep. 
So still going to be chasing that stroke. Not an easy stroke to pick up here. Certainly. It's tough. Where are you going to get it? I'm telling you, we got a par 5, par 4, and a par 3. That par 3 is jarable. Hole 9, I'm, look out for that. This, maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Par 5, up and over. Champ B is going to most likely go over that little uh, rocky ridge. Looks like both guys are going to aim for the same spot. Interested to see where the pin is here because that is always... Uh, a bit of a, a sticky spot if it's up close. No, that's nice. So you can get this ball to land and release. Play that green right. Yeah, that's fine. Not as, again, need a stroke at some point here. That's a good shot. What do we have here for champ? Up and over. This looks really nice. Tracking nicely. Beautiful. Curl that thing in. That Maniacs gets up and over, but it really can't sit if you need it to, and it did there. All right, so both players now, Eagles. Giuseppe's still very much in this, of course. Just a stroke back, but the play has just been superb. All right, tougher par four. Got to be mindful, obviously, of that giant rock in the way. What kind of spin do you do? That's, all right, that's a little bit short. Stay tuned on that. That's a little bit of a longer putt. It's going to be okay, but there is a putt to income. Going with the sniper here, trying to land it next to it. That's a golf shot there. Champ B, right three. What do we have? Bam. I'm trying to create drama. Champ B says, no thanks. None of that. Quiet commentator. Still a one-stroke lead heading into hole nine. However, ooh, not the look I don't think Giuseppe wanted. It's still jarrable. It is still jarrable, but it's a little bit of a harder look than if you're chasing a stroke. Need to have it. How hard do you hit it? So 100% looked like a different club. Can we get this magical show so it hit the rock it hit the ridge the side need to make this Ooh eee. but does but does and champ b champ v look at those scorecards minus 15 to minus 14 giuseppe put up a heck of a fight the difference however a hole out on hole one